Hello everybody, I am Ann Robinson. Welcome to my channel where it is awesome to be in. Guys, I'm coming at you today with a what? Give me a T, T, give me an A, A, give me a G, G, what does that spell? Tag. It's a tag, y'all. It's another one. <laughs> It's been a while since I had to, you know, gotten the opportunity to do a tag. And I was tagged by Mary Ellen with Sensational After 60. And again, it is the Guilty Pleasures tag. So let me go ahead so I don't prolong. I cheated a little, Mary Ellen, because I cannot do things totally off the cuff. But uh, some of these I'm stuck and I'm just going to be stuck like Chuck in front of you guys. Okay, so the first question um, is the TV show you love but should not confess to. Well, there is no TV show that I love that I cannot confess to. Um, I don't watch a lot of TV. And so the only time I literally turn on my TV is when those programs come on and that will be the reality TV shows yes I do love them and right now the current one that I am watching and it just came back on is a uh, hip-hop uh, love and hip-hop Atlanta yes that's right <laughs> so yeah that would be my um, TV show that maybe I shouldn't love because it's filled with drama you know but hey Anybody can stand a little drama as long as as long as the drama is over there and not over here, right? Right. All right. Let's see. Number two. Food you eat? What? Okay. So guys, there is no food that I eat that is that strange. I mean, I could give you. Uh, uh, okay. Well, I can give you uh, chitterlings, but of course. Uh, uh, chitterlings, you know, but uh, that might make some folks cringe. So, yeah, I guess I will say that, but I was going to say hot sauce because I eat hot sauce on a lot. I mean, that is one condiment that, that I am not without, okay? Yeah, that would be my holy grail of condiments. Yes, I put that on everything. Ain't that what that old lady said? Okay. Anywho, guys, let me move on. So I would put hot sauce on my chitterlings for sure. All right. So let's go. Um, num number three, music I love that others just cringe at. Well, now the only thing that would make some people in my life cringe because they believe that music is white or black and music has no color so my thing is I love me some Taylor Swift I love me back in a day because I haven't heard her do anything lately Kelly Clarkson yes okay Katy Perry okay Lady Gaga oh yeah okay turn it up turn it up turn it up yeah okay so that would be yeah maybe would make some folks cringe but for me, yeah, people in my family, my friends, you know, yeah, that, you know, may, may make them cringe. But you guys, y'all are hip. I know that some of y'all are like on the low, low Taylor Swift fans, right? Okay. All right. Number four, my guilty online habit. Well, guys, I have to say that is YouTube. Um, yeah, YouTube. First of all, um, my family and my friends don't really a lot of them don't even know that I have a, a YouTube channel okay uh, yeah uh, a lot of people even my co-workers do not know that I have a YouTube channel now I do have a couple of folks that I've, I've worked with that have learned that I have a YouTube channel and um, they watch and uh, I have one family member that had put a comment down in the comment section and you talk about somebody who looked and had to double look and relook again to say how in the world did she find me but she found me and I said oh I'm busted <laughs> I'm busted you guys probably know more about me than some of the folks in my own family and uh, uh people that even I work with I mean if they ask maybe they would get to know a girl right 
Maybe if you come around, you will get to know and yeah okay guys so let me move on guys because i could stay on that but youtube really would be my guilty online habit i spent a lot of time watching youtube more so than tv okay and also guys just being having a channel it, it sometimes i feel guilty and sometimes i want to say come watch my channel um I'm just uh, shy. I'm still shy and don't know how I'm shy about the people in my immediate uh, surroundings knowing I have a channel. But I am. I really am. It's called, uh, you. I want to be free of judgment. And I mean, I guess that's odd coming from me saying it, but I just want to be free of judgment, guys. Um, family can be so judgmental and friends too. And you guys, uh, I, I love you guys. I love all of my subscribers. And I have a pretty pretty good subscriber base i don't get really negative comments underneath it i have had a few but i know how to block i know how to delete okay but i mean as far as judgmentalism i don't get that too much from you guys but i tell you what family is an interesting uh yeah family can be interesting friends can be interesting but like i said they don't really tune in all right thank you guys for tuning in Thank you guys for being subscribed to Little O. Who and? All right, guys, that was a long answer for that, just that one question. All right, so clothes I love to wear but shouldn't. Well, now, sometimes I feel guilty about wearing graphic t-shirts. Uh, and when I say graphic t-shirts, that means I love t-shirts with sayings on them. I love them. I love them. I have lots of them. And I um, love t-shirts that have... I. I I try harder to um, manage what I pick out when it comes to the picture uh, stuff, you know, because one, I was going to get one and it had a picture. I think it was Beavis and Butthead. Guys, do y'all remember them back in the day? And I thought that would be hilarious to wear because that's back in my day kind of cartoon. And uh, my daughter looked at me like, are you crazy? So I, I chose to leave it in the store, but I, I dare to wear some crazy gear okay all right so yeah that would be um clothes that i may love to wear but shouldn't just cause of my age you know but hey age is nothing but a number <laughs> all right and so number six movies you should not love so much but do okay so i guess guys I will go I don't go to the movies often and it has to be something that I'm really really interested in going to see not just because it's a thriller or whatever and I don't like I'm 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 not into thrillers okay I'm not into horror I'm not into any of that I love to go ch see chick flick flicks and you know, um, maybe dramas might, might get my attention. Comedy may get my attention. But what I really love to go see is like my childhood um, childhood movies. <laughs> you know, things that was back in the day like Maleficent. Boy, when that was coming out, I knew long ahead I was wanting to go see that movie. When Alice in Wonderland uh, came out, I was I was on it and couldn't wait to go and see it. So that, that may be one of my little... Uh, Maybe movies that I should not love so much, but I do. I miss Cinderella. Uh, I wanted to see that. I think, or has it came out yet? I think it has. And I missed it, but um, yeah. So, anywho. Um, number seven. Funny. Oh, guys, it, it, you know, about the childhood movies thing, it's got to be the kid in me. We all should have a little bit of kid in us. Yes, keeps us young. All right. So, anywho. On to um, number seven. Funny habit people comment on about me well guys now i have facial expressions okay facial expressions will get you know me a comment from people um my laugh is uh you know it it, it will get people to turn around and look you know so maybe that's a funny habit that people comment on regarding me my laugh and yeah um my corny jokes yeah yeah and and uh, of course my facial expressions will make someone laugh for no reason okay and i'm not even trying okay number eight makeup look you love but it is all so wrong guys i was started to say well there is no makeup uh look that i love but that is so wrong because nowadays People are doing everything with makeup. It used to be blue eyeshadow. You better not wear no blue eyeshadow out the house. Because blue eyeshadow brought blue. No, no, you're not. 
green? No, you're not. Okay. But now that's out the door. But no, the look that I have in mind is goth. G-O-T-H. I love a goth look. Yes, I do, guys. I love goth. I love it. I love it. I love black eyeshadow. I could just slap some black on and black liner and go and my black lipstick to match. Honey, yes. All black. Yes, I can do it. Yes, I can. Yes, I love it. Yes, I still do it. I wear black lipstick, guys. And um, there is a lipstick now blue, funny as it may sound that I like golf and I have no problem wearing, um, black lipstick out of the house. I don't care. I can wear it. Uh, I don't have a problem with wearing vampy. I love it. Vampy dark purple lipsticks. Now guys, you, you have seen me in recent videos and people are commenting and calling it blue. No ma'am and no, uh, no ma'ams. No ma'ams. It's not blue. It's probably this camera messing up the whole color of it. But no, that would be purple. Purple, purple, purple. Yes, it is purple. Yes, not blue because blue I am not so secure in wearing out the door except on my fingers. Yes, that fingernail polish, you know, but blue, no, not on my lips going out the door, okay? So yeah, guys, purple. So when you see me in videos, most likely it is purple, not blue. All right, guys, so yeah, that is the end of this tag. So that means that this is the end of the video. <laughs> thank you guys for stopping by and watching and I want to thank you again and again. All right, guys. Um, I will see you where in my next video. Peace and blessings. What? Until next time. <laughs>